Hey, and we're back. It's literally one second after I hit pause. Let's keep going. I mean, maybe this is the kind of thing where you um are supposed to pause your Let's Play. And that goes back to the hotel. Pause your Let's Play and resume when you find the interesting thing. But that's... I'm gonna be real. If, if you're watching these videos, what you're gonna get, and I should put this in the description or something, is just straight up me playing the game and then uploading the footage. Unless I massively fuck something up, I, I just can't honestly be bothered to edit these to a more concise thing. I just essentially upload them as recorded. Um, because I have enough hobbies as it is, and I do not need video editing to become one of them. If if these videos start getting any kind of meaningful amount of engagement, um, I like I'd be down to like hire an editor, but that's when I'm, you know, getting more than fifteen views a video, which I'm currently not, so, you know. I don't know, just share my videos on TikTok or something. I don't know. If you want me to not aimlessly wander the streets hoping I can find 22 robot boulevard. Oh my god, that dude just sh shot me point blank. That was like an execution. Okay, I'm just gonna get my ass kicked real quick. God, my sword caught on the awning again. That guy's just gonna miss me. Da 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 da. Da da da. Can that get monetized if I hum a tune I don't even recall the source of? Is there like actual. Let's see if I can find any kind of actual address on anything. I see no indication of what's number building any of these are. So I'm gonna assume no, and I'm gonna keep going, and I'm gonna try to find a locked door. Let's check our collectibles. We are again looking for Elysian Boulevard 22B. Where that is, no idea. How to find it, no idea. Well, beyond aimlessly wandering until something has a door I can open. You know, I, I was talking with my boss about this game today, um, and he made a really good point that the fact that the combos are all just two swings is probably just an effort to cap down on animation costs between so many different weapons and so many different movesets. Just a way to save a little bit of time and money in a thing that really just does not matter all that much. Like, the weapons feel good to use. Like, I don't, I don't care that I don't have a full... You know, like three to five move combo, like you would in a a, um, a FromSoft game. Ow, sweet God! At least he didn't knock me off. Um, like I, I don't honestly miss that. It's not a big deal to me. I'm just finding out, especially because in these style of games, you never really get more than like one to three attacks off before you need to back away and sort of recollect yourself, prepare for incoming fire. So having me just spam two attacks is like totally fine. It just you you lose basically nothing. It's all upside. So actually, the more I think about it, the more I like it from a design perspective, not necessarily from a player perspective. From a player perspective, I'm indifferent, right? Because it just doesn't matter. I I never swing more than a few times, anyways. But from a design perspective, I appreciate how much time and money they saved, and they were able to put that towards more meaningful parts of the game instead of wasting time on these animations. Like, they've got all these awesome, gigantic, bespoke bosses so far and really interesting enemies that are animating in wacky ways. Like, um, all the, the fire boss, the engine, who would, like, rotate himself backwards against his own momentum to swing at you. I think um, Robocop did that, too. Are really ex like we've seen the crazy tendrils on some of the um, petrified monsters. Have I been up? Ow! 
So like taking the time to make those animations varied and look and feel very good over spending time creating an individual anim suite for every weapon, I think is absolutely the right call. So that's another stargazer. I almost certainly have not been here. Nope, this just, it's the same thing, just goes around. You need to take this long ass ladder up or you can just walk right here. But at least you get loot if you go to the top, presumably, that I've already gotten. I don't know. Where is this goddamn apartment? I'm just gonna, it doesn't matter. Oh, there's shopkeep. I mean, this is the house. I'm, I'm gonna stop to actually to check. This is the house on whatever boulevard, right? Yeah, inside the house on Sun Sun Boulevard, Elysian. So we are at least still in the right area, you know? Hey, look! It was right next to the Stargazer. It was the first door. We have another vault. Destroy that door. You know, that logo with the two hands, ooh, around what it, mm, I was going to say it's a triangle, but I don't think it's indicative of the Trinity. It might be, but I think those are just calipers like engineers would use in their plans. Owl doctors hunting apparel and some cords. I can get the get up after rolling thing. Um, owl doctors hunting apparel. The hunting apparel of the owl doctor. It looks normal, yet there is something gruesome about it. I decided to give them repose when they were still human. This was his last vow before he has lost his ego as a doctor. Neat. Still not. Still not something I like. I played too much Bloodborne, I'm sorry. Um, okay, let's go back to Hotel Stargazer. <laughs> Man, having, like, you know, in, in Dark Souls, it's the homeward bone. So that's what people call in the community, boning out. Being able to, to go back to base or your most recent Stargazer at any time without it costing you your ergo is so nice. Do I have enough to level up? I might be close. Oh, I do. Um... You know what, I'm pretty sure I tried to level up my stamina and instead leveled up my carry capacity last time. Okay. That is, I think, enough stalling. I think I've investigated everything I, I care to at the moment. Hmm. The invention of automated puppets made everyone stop caring about everything else. What is that? That's something or friend. Fiend or friend, maybe? I'm wondering if that's the hunter I need to find in order to trade my big ergo for special weapons. I would really like to find that guy. I'm, I'm very curious to find out what a special weapon entails. I'm a little nervous because I, I worry that it'll mean I can't disconnect the blade and the handle. Like, it's guaranteed to be a solid piece. Um... And, you know, those weapons might be cool regardless, but so far what I, what I find really cool about the system is being able to create these weapons myself. So if it turns out that some of the best weapons are just um, created by the developers and I just equip them instead of putting the pieces together myself, I am going to be a little bit disappointed. But we uh, still need to find out. Can't say for sure yet. Let's... I, he's got to be soon, right? I mean, we're, we're pretty deep in the game to be still discovering fundamental new mechanics. And special weapons are maybe what's really left. I don't remember exactly where I'm supposed to go. I'm hoping... Oh yeah, this elevator. I said I don't remember exactly where I'm supposed to go. Oh, I didn't want to go down. I thought about it right before I flipped the thing. I was like, what if this takes me downwards instead of upwards? And then for sure it did because that giant spooky thing tunneled downwards. Okay, I should hammer time. Okay, we've got... Do we still need this? Oh, didn't I get a new amulet? No, I did not. If I equip that. Okay, I still have... 
Well, that would be increased damage on puppets, but this is not going to be a puppet, so I will just equip those regardless. Let's equip all the best armor I can get. What do you think this is going to do? Slash, pierce, or strike? I think strike is blunt, and this being a giant tentacle monster, I imagine it'll be blunt. That didn't change any visuals. Okay, I didn't think it did. Ah, shit. Um, this is going to be a whole thing. Oh, you know, I can't do fire damage on my hammer because it's already elementally charged. I wonder if I should actually go back to my normal weapon for now, but I think I won't. I think we'll find out what happens. What the fuck? I just wasn't ready for someone to start talking. Some thermite, good. Happy to have it. I heard the voice from over here. Oh. Hello, sister. I'm surprised to see who's well alive. She looks a little rough. I I don't oh, know how good the quality is for you guys, but she's like I'm scarred Cecile, and stuff. And oh, I her hands wrapped. I'm the only one left. Everyone's dead. From the petrification disease or from the monsters. I didn't die. But my heart breaks more each day. Interesting that she said monsters, Maybe but the subtitle said monster. Bring me the holy mark from the archbishop's quarters. The archbishop was a true saint. He was my savior. If I write his words into my heart, maybe it'll give me the strength to carry on. I can't die. I'm so twitchy, dude. But perhaps this can help me live again. Wait, you can't die? Please, bring me the holy mark as quickly as you can. What do you mean you can't die? Are you saying you don't want to die? You should avoid dying? I mean, that, that I would hope that goes without saying, but I can't die is an interesting way to put that. Um, okay, so this goes down into the mock, but then there's a gate. So I'm guessing I have to go left to open the gate first. So maybe I should... Yeah, I'm gonna actually... Ow, what the fuck? <laughs> There's a trap. That was such a bad time to switch my weapon. What did I step... Oh, you see that plate there. Mm. We're gonna have to be careful. Oh my god, dude. Well, fucking what if... That didn't do anything. Oh, they're just environmental hazards. I swear I hear someone on my left. I wonder if they're just behind that gate is all. Um, I don't have any saw blades. Oh, there's a hole in the floor there. Oh, there's other holes! I hate all of this. Okay, well that went surprisingly well. Just in time for me to... jinx myself. That looks like a fake one. It does sound like they're trying to speak. I don't know if they are. If that hits me, I take a shitload of decay damage. Does this just go right back? No, there's no way it goes right back down. Oh my god. This environment is so spooky. This is why the cathedral was built and remembered. Pilgrims worship the merciful angel. So I, I do remember like a one winged angel came down to people and educated them in some capacity. Okay. Ooh, pretty proud of that one. Not bad. Okay, um... Yeah, let's just see what, what's over here. Alright, well, I'm definitely gonna decay. 
I don't... Oh, Decay is just... Well, I'm sure it does something else, but it is just a damage over time as well. Oh, one of these guys. That is the first time I think I've had to grind my weapon in combat. I feel like I can feel that dodge stamina cost reduction. Man, sometimes when I try to dodge, I get stuck on the enemies, and it's terrible. Damn it. I did not have enough time. Like, I started rolling before he went red, and then I didn't have enough time to stop rolling and block by the time he hit me. That's pretty rough. Acid canister, dimmer, ghost, or fragment. Okay. Is this a ladder I can climb? I doubt it. Didn't think so. I saw another um, brazier. I'm guessing I'm supposed to push that down like I did the last one. Have it smash some stuff. Oh, is this a shortcut? This might be a shortcut. If it's not a shortcut, I just made a huge, huge mistake. But I am, I am out of... Whatever it's called, I keep forgetting. Pulse cells. Ah, damn it! I can't find the way out. Monsters everywhere. I need to grab my share and leave. What a view! <laughs> hey, it is Alidoro. Oh, that's odd. It's got a German Shepherd. I thought I was the only one with a sound mind here. I'm sure, I don't need to introduce myself. Note these golden wings. Yes, you guessed it. You don't know who I am. Preposterous! Everyone in Kratz has heard of me. Do you live under a rock? Well, I'm a puppet. I'm Alidoro the Hound. Treasure hunter extraordinaire. Yes, yeah, it's a nickname. I ditched my real name in the past. I'm looking for other survivors of this disaster, but it's uh, been a lonely search, and there's danger around every corner. Do you know of a place where I can take refuge? Preferably someplace clean and comfortable, you know. Civilized. Oh, I had to be careful about who I tell. <laughs> Hotel Kratz. Of course. A haven for all. And it's still safe and sound, you say. I have a lot of searching ahead of me, so why don't I lighten my load? Consider this an act of charity. But thank you, Gift. Take it. That's Since you're so almost helpful, nothing. I'll give you a peek at my collection. Show me what you're worthy of. Rare Ergo. Kill strong enemies to gain rare Ergo. Alidoro is a treasure hunter who collects this rare Ergo. In exchange for Alidoro's precious weapons or amulets. So I've got... I have to decide. Oh, no. Upon a successful perfect guard, temporarily increase damage afflicted by weapon attacks. Oh, that's so good. Or I can get... Oh, but I cannot disassemble the Holy Sword of the Ark. Which does seem good. But yeah, you can't disassemble any of those. And that was exactly what I was worried about. And... They don't scale excellently with motivity. And I don't know that I can change their handles such that they would seven explosions, that's called. Strong downward blood. When you cut downward, multiple explosions will deal damage to the enemies in front of you. Okay, what does the amulet do? Enables dodging even with low stamina. Oh my god, that sounds good. Increase weapon attack in proportion to number of fable slots. Interesting. Um, I mean, here here's the thing is I only have so many talisman slots. But these weapons don't excite me because, again, I cannot disassemble them. So I just don't want them. So I think we'll go amulets just across the board. Since you're so helpful. As a descendant of aristocrats, the very best families, Fuck you. I have a duty to the common people. I live my life fulfilling that duty. And part of that duty is ensuring these items are returned to their rightful owners. What I'm showing you is just a portion of the 
collection. If you come to the refuge, we'll be able to continue our confabulation. Until then, remember this hound when golden wings shine. Whose golden wings will be shining, dude? Alright, well, I said we were probably gonna find that dude soon. Nailed it. My game dev senses were tingling. Um, but I am completely out of pulse cells. So I would like some kind of shortcut or something. That's an empty animation. Um, okay. So this one that increases weight limit, I probably don't need. Oh my god, they're so heavy. What the hell? Holy shit, that's a 20 pound amulet. I, I, okay, that's dumb. Like, I already lose the opportunity cost of getting those, those weapons. These should not be so goddamn heavy. All of these make me slightly heavy. I mean, I guess I have, like, the, the strongest... shit money can buy maybe I need to downgrade it well which which ones do I actually want okay increase max HP that's like 10% that's not nothing I don't I just don't see a ton of value in having a carrier amulet just so I can have another good amulet enable dodging even when low stamina that's pretty good extreme modification amulet or conquering amulet upon a successful per guard Increased damage afflicted by weapon attack. That's only good sometimes. This is... Th I think that's it. God, but then the problem is I literally... Oh, maybe... Maybe I can go. No, I would have to get below 60. <laughs> what, what am I willing to spend to be able to... Okay, can I just... Okay. You know, you know what? That's worth it. Ah, uh, I see. It's super heavy because it's effectively armor. Oh, God. That scared the shit out of me. Because armor is where a lot of that weight comes from. And this is basically armor in that it is just damage reduction. You can, you can dodge more. And that is protective. So I guess it makes sense that it weighs as much as it does. Cecil's unwell again today. The Adams brothers found her standing like one of the dead at the edge of a cliff and brought her back. If it's mild sleepwalking, it's fine, but I'm worried it's her old blood compulsiveness again. I know about her strong beliefs better than anyone else, so it's really too bad. God will be glad with the atoned. Perhaps I should ask her for atonement for visiting the Isle of Alchemists. I have their relic in my hand, thanks to Cecil. I won't let those bastards ruin Crot anymore. This will purify the city. Maybe it was a mistake to accept those guys from the beginning. This disaster was divine judgment. They should have been turned away all those 30 years ago, but this will be the end. Crot is a city blessed by God, and I, Andreas, will come to its rescue. Why me? Lamau got him. Archbishop's Holy Mark. That quest is complete. Is this more quartz? Union workshop. Union strengthening frame. I mean, I almost definitely can't wear that. But it's nice. The last item, the last frame item made by the workshop union. When the handcrafting workshop came out with a better item, the workshop union gave up its development. Huh. So I guess there are. That's just the last one made by a certain faction. There are more frames to be found. Um, is this the brazier I probably have to push? Push! Oh, there's some loot there. There's a ladder there now. I guess that ladder is probably already there. So far, these ceiling things, I'm sure do a shitload of damage if they do hit me, but it just seems like they can't possibly hit me. Okay. 
How do I... I cannot rise from that side. Oh. Gemini's emergency protection. Um, and then that's the elevator. We came up here. Man, I can run for a long time out of combat. I wonder if they made a change to that, actually. There have been patches to the game as I've been playing it. And one thing I, I commented on was I didn't see the point in draining my stamina outside combat. It decreasing at that kind of a rate is fine. That's a fine compromise. God, it's just a fucking maze. Okay, let's come here because we have no whatever and we're right next to the lady and we can recharge all of our pull cells and then give her her thing and she can be like oh my god thank you here's oh, a cool you. weapon just seeing the archbishop's holy mark renews my spirit awesome give me a weapon it's a reminder of the quiet power of faith i'll remember this forever stalker you gave me an attribute resistance it's a reminder ampoule of the Remind Dude. That sucks. I did all that work for that? Okay, I don't think I even tried this door. Okay, for a good reason. Can't open it. Who is playing the... Okay, I don't know if you can hear this through whatever device you're on, but the organ has an origin. Um... Oh, I did it again. Uh, so in development generally there's basically like two kinds of sounds oh i never went down let's find out um there are what are called 2d sounds which just play at your position on your screen basically Ooh, a legion caliber i need that to upgrade my arm Ooh, one of these fucks um and then there are 3d sounds which what did i just not do enough damage Oh my god. They fucking... Okay, that was really funny. I tri I don't know if you could... I triggered a trap there and that shot me. And then I tried to run away from it and a different one hit me. Advance crank. Okay, so that's what I would need to have a handle scale with advance. Nope, not again. This place is cursed. It is the abyss of hell. You cannot leave. The only thing waiting for you is despair. And occasional loot. You forgot about the loot, my good corpse. Oh, and then this is Radiant Ergo Fragment. Open this door, which is not actually a shortcut, just a way to get back. They call it the Arm of God. You arrogant ones, you have called the wrath of God upon yourselves. The Arm. They were calling my Fulminus the Arm of God, weren't they? Or were they just saying it's the power of God instilled in an arm? I just don't want to fight these things. I don't see the point. I'm just going to go. I don't. I'm starting to get lost. This area is very dense. Ow. I should maybe have bothered to dodge that at all. Yeah, I think it's... Because this was all decay, so I didn't come down into this at all. Maybe not at all, but I certainly did not go through this next door. Oh, no! Nice to be able to dodge 100% of the time. Is it worth having effectively no armor? I don't know yet. Time will tell, but I'm going to guess yes with the way I play this stupid game. Oh, this game's awesome. The way I play games in general, I'm so aggressive. I'm so unsafe. Being able to dodge at any time is way up my alley. Okay. Can't go there. There's a ladder there. Oh, hey. Nope, can't get up there either. Can't get up that way. There's a door there. Is there a door on the left side? It looks like there is. Okay. Shit. 
Oh, uh, let's kill a guy. Yeah, I'm guessing. I'm guessing that's the way up and around through here. Mm, can I go more higher? I believe I can. Yeah, here we go. Okay. You know, it's weird. They have a lot of ambushes, but I rarely get hit by them, and I am not being careful. I feel like they just miss. Like, I don't I don't deserve to dodge these guys. They just, they just miss me while I'm full sprinting everywhere all the time. Did I actually go through here? Yes, I did, and then I dropped out of the Stargazer. Oh, and then this will open the gate to the Stargazer, and then wha-bam. Shortcut. Resplendent Ergo Fragment. Uh, let's just rest. Alright, and I'm guessing it's boss time. And, uh, and sing praise for the new saint has arrived. I, Saint Andreas, will consecrate this land. Oh, that's one of the summoning pools. I don't want to use that. Okay, well now I think it's hammer time. And if this goes really poorly, we'll try the sword. Ooh, like slashed the uh, painting of St. Andreas. Are its arms folded across its chest? I think they are. I think it's upside down. Or maybe I'm upside down. See, you put things up high. No one ever looks up. Is that Saint Andreas? Distorted into the curse? Looks decidedly unimpressed. Oh no, he's scared. I spooked him. It's all good. Look at that face. Upside down. Oh my god. See, like, that is such a cool boss model. Holy shit, that's a cool character. Like, that, I'm so glad they ignored. Oh my god, I was right. It is the Fallen Archbishop. Ha, you didn't decay me in one hit. Okay, so it seems like if I... Oh, okay. Oh my god, the range. And he keeps attacking. Oh, and then he can just jump backwards and hit me with his butt. Don't I have quartz? Why didn't I go back and get the thing that lets me roll off the ground? That would be really nice right now. gonna charge me. Ow. Oh, Decay breaks my weapon. Oh, I forgot Decay fucks up my weapon. See the durability drop to nothing? Okay. Um, I'm not sure I'm... Alchemist of Brilliant Scientist Doctor is not generous. God damn. I can never read those. Um, I'm just not sure I'm good enough with a slow weapon like this to make it happen. Okay, what did I just say I should have done? What did I just forget to do? God bless it. Do I ever remember anything? Um, I do kind of want to switch this to the Flambearish. But... Oh, I'm slightly heavy right now. Or I would be if I used the Flambearish? Oh my god, that's a cool weapon. 
Am I? Oh, I would be slightly heavy with this. Okay. Sucks to suck. I just can't. I just can't. I also don't actually think this is really helping me right now. I really wish it were. Um, so it's seeming like this is going to be a lot of strike damage. I need whatever gives me the most corruption resistance or decay resistance. Which this, none of these have any of. Whatever. Corrosion. Acid damage reduction rate. Acid resistance. That's what I'm looking for. And then, can I get that without going slightly heavy? Oh, come on. Whatever, it's fine. Um, is the max HP amulet still worth it? I mean, what would I replace it with? Oh, I don't even have the one I want. So maybe if I do that, I can do a better... Actually, oh, I do have just the heaviest chip possible. Dope. Okay. Um, does that mean I can do this without heavy rolling? It does. I still don't think that's a good idea. I can't equip both, for sure. I can't equip both. I wish I could. Um, let's give the hammer another try before we go back to old reliable. I really think old reliable is the way to go, but I spent a lot of time on this hammer and I want to use it. Ooh, I tried to block a second too. Got the block. Missed that block. Oh my god, it hit. Ooh, I got the shock off. That just drops it at my feet? Why does that just drop it at my feet? Get some stagger, maybe? Oh, close. Alright, I've probably got to get in front of his mouth, right? Yep. Wow, I am doing way better. Spoke too soon. Oh, the range on that. I'm finding it much easier to just ignore that attack. the shock. Oh, way too early. Let's heal so we can start recharging another cell. I think we just fucking beat him to death. Wait, no, there's a whole other health bar? This feels like there's going to be a second health bar. Is he going to peel himself open? Oh, no. Oh, and then the Archbishop, like, small form. This is very... Ninja Gaiden 2 with the giant monster unleashing like a little but somehow scarier demon. He's got like millipede legs. And his face is just a mouth. That's what the mask was covering. 10 out of 10. I fucking hate it.
<gasps> He's got the one wing. Is this God? Dude, I wasn't claiming to sense the presence of God. That is not my purview, I don't think. Don't care for it to be. Oh my god, he's just swinging and swinging and swinging, and I am almost certainly dead. Where is everyone, and why do I taste blood? For sure. That was a very spooky phase transition. Okay. Let's try O Reliable. Let's see how that does. Um, yeah, Decay Bad. Um, you know, I also did not use my arm literally at all. But I'm not sure this is the arm I want anyways. It's not. I mean, none of them are really upgraded. I've got the weight to use Flimberish. It is a giant decay monster, so I think it should be weak to this kind of damage. Oh, I should have put that on Strike. Strike seems correct, but I really have no way of knowing, unfortunately. Um, and maybe we prepare some consumables, some fire abrasive. Let's get some fire abrasive. And once more under the breach. I am going to wait until phase two, I think, to spend my um my special grind. Oh, that is quick swipe he does there. Oh, it's like a quick shuffle backwards. Ah, oh, that came out much faster than I expected it to. Oh, he's swinging again. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm better than you. I was really hoping that would get a stagger. No, I, I was pressing the button and it didn't take. There's no way I hit him in time. Nope. God, that sucks. Oh my god, in the chase, dude. Oh, how did that miss, dude? There we go. Let's heal first. And that'll give us a whole bunch of our vial back. Ooh, I got that block just in time. thought I'd get far enough away. Dude, he has got some range on his abilities. Fuck. 
Okay, I remember what I wanted to do. I wanted. I I think I have a quartz. I wanted to go back and and get the ability to dodge out of being uh, knocked to the ground, which I still think should not be a thing. That feels like basic locomotion. That should not be locked behind stuff. But what are you gonna do? Um, I do have a quartz. Okay, so let's. I don't even have to talk to that thing. I'll go talk to Geppetto. Get some quartz. Although the disease... Oh. Antonia is also afflicted with... The plague. Um, also, do you sell unlimited fire braces? That would be really nice. I'm guessing you don't. You don't. You don't sell anything. I also did not use my flamberge at all again. I should at least make sure I'm using that during phase one. I'm glad I didn't use any of the fire paper. I don't think that would have been um, worth the resource, but when I get a little more confident, I'll start spending shit like that. Uh, okay. Yeah, I should get something offensive eventually, right? I don't think I felt great about any of this. Does any of this enhance the recovery effect of pulse cells? That would be nice. You know what? I am going to increase stagger attack of dodge and dash attacks because I do dodge and dash attacks all the goddamn time. Increase destruction damage to enemies when a perfect guard is successful. I just don't know if destruction damage is useful against bosses. Like, can I destroy this dude's tongue? That just does not seem right to me, you know? Um, can I teleport right out of the hotel using that locket that would be really cool uh, either that or it teleports me downstairs which actually would still be faster than walking huzzah okay and let's teleport to the library and we'll try this again Saint Frangelico met an angel with one wing. The path that the monks climbed while praying for those in need was called the path of misery. So Saint Frangelico met an angel with one wing, and yet he is the one winged angel? Or did he merge with the one winged angel when shit started going down and he was like, I need power or something like that? Who's to say? All right, you know what? I I I am gonna do at least this. Okay, or I'll get hit. Oh my god, the range on that is abysmal. Oh, but the damage is actually really nice. And the startup. Oh my god, it's like instant fire. No more fire. Oh my god. Oh, that was so nice being able to get up from being knocked down. It was everything I wanted it to be. Okay, Flamberish feels very good to use. Oh, well, I'm out of Flamberish. Just back to back. That's gonna hit me. Oh my god, swing! <sighs> oh my goodness. Five attacks in a row.
Oh no! Well, it's uh, it's not going well, boys. I wonder if it's still safer to just fight this dude in the back. Oh, I kind of. Yeah. Gold will be our grave. Is that a ref? Someone was the the. Shit. Who was looking for gold? Someone was looking for gold. Something. Okay. I think I can only give this like two more tries before I gotta call it, and I might just clip all this off the episode and say, "Hey, I just got my ass kicked over and over and over." The, the twitchiness of the attacks, I'm not always loving. It feels a little cheap at times. Like, it's really hard for me to figure out... Okay, I can't figure out where I'm going. No, if I'm going to use Flambearish, I just got to go fucking all out. And make sure he's on fire. Like, yeah, the twitchiness of the attacks makes it really hard to read when to get those perfect parries. And I don't love it. Feels a little mean sometimes. Like, yeah, that just comes out like instantly. can heal and then I can blah, 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 and guarantee all that damage stays. I can get some free hits. I think I need to learn the timing is what I need right now actually. Oh no, he reared back. And it cost me a lot of health. Okay. Did he is he hiding from me? Damn it, I thought I could get under him before he dropped down. Am I the arm of God? Okay, let's do it. Fuck. Oh my god, get over here. 
Greed! Greed's so hard! Oh my god! Oh, oh that was so hard! Oh. Those are those are the other main bosses as well. What the hell? I didn't like beat the game, did I? I would be really upset if I beat the game. There's no way. I, no, I just sent that dude back to the hotel. All their ergo is going to the top of something and being collected. Oh, and then fired as a weapon for sure. Who the fuck? And now, the stage is set. <laughs> it doesn't sound like Geppetto. <laughs> so he wanted me to go kill those guys so that he could collect their ergo? Hey, look at that health. Not even close. Eliminated. Twisted Angel's Ergo. I want to go back to the old crowd. The old me. Before the green overtook me. Alright, well, I am going to go back to base and I am going to do some housekeeping. I will uh, begin the next video after that and I will do a little update at the start of it on everything I did back at base so that uh, you guys don't miss too much of the details, but you don't have to sit here and watch all the housekeeping. So thank you so much for watching. I've been Kevin Scorch. Have a good rest of your day.